Hello and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Battletech modded Road Tech where today we are going to change up the mission types but unfortunately uh, I really want to go for this assassination mission but what's stopping me is the fact that I basically am fielding three mechs plus either an urban mech or a locust and um, <sighs> We could end up taking on too many medium mechs on this one. Well, the, at least the assassination target is going to be a medium mech, so that's not good. I think we're going to stick with the one skull missions for the moment, just to build up some parts and hopefully get some actual mech salvage. So let's just check storage. See, we have... Yeah, we have the... Oh, wow, I've completely forgot about the urban mech, haven't I? I mean, it's an urban mech, so it's garbage. Um, you see, I've got a few parts of these. So, that's a sentinel. Which is a crab variant. But that's still, that's, you know, more armour than a stupid locust. So, let's see. Let's re-ready up the urban mech. Doesn't cost me anything. Let's see what's left of it. So, there is... Nothing left. Wow, we got. Ugh. If I repair, what are we. Uh, we got fire control, energy. Basic, 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 nothing, nothing. Wow, we get absolutely nothing out of that. We get two double heat sinks and a fire control, energy. Good news is, I can just scrap it and the scrap value is. Wow. Wow, 57,000. I mean, it's 57,000 I didn't have. Um, there's no point keeping it around because it's garbage. So, yeah, let's just scrap it. That's, that's the difference between normal Battletech, Battletech Advance, and then extremely hard mode Rogue Tech. So, yeah, there is that. Okay, well, let's go... No, we can't do that. We need to... I keep forgetting about this bit as well. So, we need to get everyone out of fatigue. And... One more day for the crab. We've got one more day for that financial report, but we're not going over it just yet. Let's jump into this mission. I'm thinking maximum salvage whilst we still got the chance. 201,000 is still a decent amount. So... I'm going to swap out the um, Locust for the Urban Mech, because we're not going to need to move too much. Therefore, the Urban Mech should be able to get into the fight a bit more. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you do, remember to hit the like button. And if you want to see more videos and show support for the channel, remember to hit the subscribe button. Okay, here we go. And... Do we, we have some allies, which is good. That's always handy. And let's see. We are spread out a little bit. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. So. What do you need? Let's. We have to hunt off for eight turns. Sure, buildings. Okay, so they're over that way. Right. Escort. Does that, does that mean we get turrets? I think we might get turrets. Nice. Let's push you through the Let's move. there because I want the flames on the front line. Uh, sadly, the open mech is still at the back of it all. Are we actually in, we are in combat. Yeah. Interesting. Can't see anyone just yet. Affirmative. But let's see what happens on the first turn, or with the first with the first turn. What's up, boss? You go down there for me. Can you get light of sight? You can. What the hell was that? Looked more like infantry than a mech. But I've also lost sight of it. It's there. Buildings tagged. Okay. Interesting. 
You can't. Ah, uh, you don't quite get in there. You will get in there, hopefully. And rain in your slow ass mech. Uh, yeah, let's just go there. High tailing it. I mean, I can't go. Can't go anywhere else, really. So let's just go there. So armored car. That doesn't sound like it's going to survive much in the way of firepower. Ready and for I'm thinking you get us a line of sight, please. And let's see what's out here. Okay. Go I see something. I see a down. mech. But it is a. Okay. I found three things: uh, a sling, a stinger, and an inner sphere standards. Oh, Flamer, Inferno, SRMs, holy cow, I don't like that. It doesn't really have much in the way of armor, but at the same time, I think that is infantry. And I think I'm going to go for... That's a light mech, that's another light mech. That's got no sense also, so let's go for the Stinger, see if we can drop it. Yeah. Ooh, wait, we do more damage to this guy. Why? This guy's got a PPC. Let's try to take out the stinger. Firing four on I mean, that's a good, some good solid hits and structure exposed. So that is right handy. Mm -hmm. Right, can you get in range? You can get in range. Look at that. Confirmed. And who do we want to go for? I think we go for the kill on this guy. Yeah. Here we go. There we go. Destroids. That was nice and quick. Sadly, these are going to... Oh, they're not doing anything. I was going to say, sadly, they're going to um, cook one of my mechs. Yeah. But they don't, so I'm happy. And I get to Roger. test out my new build of the Firestarter. Flamers Inferno SRMs. We go for the Inner Sphere dudes. I mean, they've got SRM Inferno missiles, so I'm going to be potentially getting a lot more SRMs and Inferno stuff. You went through the fire. You're stupid. Uh, you did shoot the building again. A different building, maybe. Okay, what have we got? The turrets are coming online. Good. Good, good, good. That means that these few puny, few puny turrets... Oh, wait, no. Dual mortar flare. Uh, light thunderbolts. LRM and... Advanced AMS machine gun. Okay, that's a bit garbage. Got something you want done? Yeah, I still don't think you're going to get into the fight at all. How annoying. I'm already there. Okay, well, I might as well just hide you in here next turn. If... Yeah, I should have probably done that this turn, actually. But hey. Ooh, we're illuminated and so are they. I don't like that. That was the thumpers missing. And then... LRMs. Getting a good chunk of damage. Yeah, they get to go first. Please don't fire, please don't fire. You are firing. Mostly missing a little bit of heat on the X. I'll take it. Hit, I will take it. Yeah. So, Gremlin. You go there for me. You're illuminated, so... Who do I go for? I might go for... The Stinger, actually. These guys are gone. We're going to be hitting uh, center of it. So, front angle, whatever. Full frontal, basically. So, we're not specifying an arm or a side or anything. Not 
spiking my crab. But thankfully, they're not doing much damage to it, so it's all good. And then yep. fire starter is definitely looking to start some fires. And uh, yeah, you can't jump again. I think we go Understood. there and put some heat on the slinger so it shuts down, or we start looking at shutting it down. So I don't think the infantry are gonna shut down. I don't know how the infantry work, if I'm honest. Yeah, lots of soft cap, but still enough individual heat sources to breach the heat Order. of that mech. If I sprint, I can spin all the way around there. I'm only getting I one evasion, so this is a stupid idea, most likely. But I think I have to shut that off and that off. Yeah. Target lock. That was a waste. Okay. Yeah. I was kind of thinking that the rear armor would have been better, but it's just. Well, we had to hit it for it to be better, and nothing hit, so it's okay. The machine guns are going to be good on all yep. of these guys because they're so weak. Yeah, let's go hide you in the forest, and it doesn't make a difference where we go, Roger truly, that. because we're only getting one evasion, but I can brace. You can guard the opposite flank. There we go. You've actually got a use of some kind. Uh, illuminating me, and a little bit of heat for everybody. There we go. Solid damage, and then the thumpers. I'm picking up a new sensor trace. Yeah. Looks like enemy reinforcements. Okay, wasn't expecting them, but I'm actually glad that I put my urban mech over that side. Who are you going for? It's like a wild shot. Oh, you're, you're still firing. Okay. Well, it's only a small laser, so I can live with that. Right. Who's next? Oh, there's a new target over there. Ultralight LRM carrier. Cougar. Something. And I think there. And there's one there. Is that it? Three targets over there. And what have we got over here? Can't see it. Just looks like two targets. Okay. Receiving you. So, what I think we're gonna do is go there and cool down. I would say. Yeah. Roger that. We missed, but it's, we got cooled down, so it's all good. Yeah. Uh, you're hot still. Wow. I'm thinking I need to jump. Not do a, not a death from above. That would be stupid. I think I need to keep Confirmed. that guy overheated. Okay, we're still overheating. I am going to fire you. Take you off. Yes. So I've got a better hit chance with you, and let's go for it. Not great, but still overheating, so that's Commander. fine. And yeah, we're going to move there. On the LBX the should be good at taking out, hopefully, the infantry people, although we're on the wrong side for the leg. That sucks. Fine. Here goes. We'll hit him regardless because it's still gonna. Oh wow, mess up the other leg. Good. Right, so let's get you moving forwards. You've got some turrets to help you as well. So you're not completely alone, but uh, it's only a vehicle so far. There's at least two targets. 
target. Going for the APC. Fair enough. I can live with that. And another vehicle. Okay, so it's only vehicles. I think mm, shouldn't be too bad. We can always try and stomp on them if all else fails. Oh, come on, get a crit. No, the machine guns should be getting crits. We are kind of outnumbered. Badly. But then again, when are we not outnumbered? Let's just say that. Ah, no crits. But he is stressed. That's good. You're stressed as well. Taking a lot of fire, but not doing anything. Okay, what's happening? What is all this? What has been dropped here to give to do this? Electrical storm rubbish. I mean, I can't even see my own mechs properly. And I also had that. I don't seem to have had a turn for a little while. There we go. Uh, so, right, what did this thumper... Uh, faint? the hell is that? Whatever it is, it screwed my vision up, basically. That's standard, and then... Where's the other turret? It's mortar. Smoke, ah! They've dropped smoke, haven't they? What do you need? So, if I go there, my hit chance is actually half decent. Uh, that's the rear armor. You know what? I'm listening. The gremlin can go first. Because I think you're going to have a better chance of taking or well, knocking All down the have. mech. Even though it's not so much a mech. I don't know. We'll see how it works, actually. Yeah, we haven't got the best chance of hitting, sadly, because of all the smoke, but... I wonder what happens when we take our leg. Does it fall over still, or what? I got. That didn't kill. But... One hit point. Yep. Okay, I think I know what I'm doing. I think I'm sprinting... Two evasion just there. And cooking this me in the back. We don't need to fire everything. I think we'll turn that off. Just fire the flamers to try and cook it. Well, to try and get the one damage, basically. There we go. Senator also destroyed. Highly incapacitated. Destroyed. Gone. So we're just down to the um, you. You're trying to fire everything. And then we need to move on to the Commander. next targets. Okay, it looks like I'm only getting one evasion and a line of sight. I can go there, but that's a really bad choice because that'd be. Okay, so if I sprint... Yeah, I can't really get anywhere. I mean, that'll do. Yeah. We're in cover as well, so that's helpful. And... Ah, we are here in the side that we haven't hit already, which is kind of annoying, but hey. Let's go for it. Roger that. We've got structure exposed and the left arm destroyed. Solid connection on that. And an engine crit, so overall that was worth it. Now thankfully they're still going for the cars, not the buildings. Because I don't I think the buildings would be falling apart otherwise. Ready for orders. Right. Uh, yeah, move forward into cover. 
And I get you. On the move. who do we go for? So, triple energy. Amazon. I'm not sure what that is. Missile and energy. I think. We just fire the tag barrage on you. See if it gets anywhere close, and then we'll just fire those for a little bit of luck. I want a better hit chance, basically, before I fire the rockets. Yeah, the tag barrage is in a good place, so if they sit still, which they don't this turn at least, so if they if they don't move next turn too far, they're going to get hit by a massive tag barrage, which is fine by me. Are you panicked? I think you might be. A nice punch out would be amazing right about now. That was a hit. Lost evasion. He's unsteady. So, a lot more going. He's gone. Awesome. Let's get this done. So, one more turn over here, and then two guys are getting hit. It looks like they might just get a hit. Right here. Mm -hmm. Good. So, if we go there. I haven't actually got a line of sight, so I don't know how good I'm hitting. Okay, let's just move then. And go there. And see. Oh, it's a VTOL. Ah. And only you that got a line of sight to, so... Sorry, let's go for it. Uh, we got six damage on it. That is a cougar. Yeah. Where All of these it? mechs don't sound like something I would want, if I'm honest. But, at the end of the day, Affirmative. we just need to kill everything on this mission, then try and get some of the internal stuff so that we can get better stuff. You've got a garbage hit chance. I've got a better hit chance with the large lasers, so let's fire. Target acquired. No, doesn't work. Failed to connect. And what do you need? You're going to be nowhere near, are you? Even with a sprint. Copy that. I mean, the SRMs are in range, so we might as well see what we can do with those. And uh, no, no reason to fire everything or anything. So let's just done. Okay, you're out of the bubble. That sucks. I think only one of those has to move, or um, has still to move. Therefore, it's guaranteed to get hit. I'm guaranteed to hit at least one thing with a tank barrage, finally. Okay, still going for the buildings. They're holding up, though. They are holding up. And... Whose turn is it? I think it's the VTOLs. And they tend to take a little time because they are rather indecisive in where they want to go. You want to go there. And... Okay. I'll take that one miss. Oh yes, you stay in there. You stay in there. Good. Awesome, right, it should be coming down now because that's about everything can move for this turn. Apart from rain. Waiting for orders. So let's see, what hit chance do you have? Pretty good. Crap. 21, 26. I think... I fire as many of those as I can. I've got to turn one off, sadly. 
Actually, no bollocks. I'm only slightly over, so if we shut down, so be it. That is 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 160 rockets. Some of them are going to hit. But not enough of them, apparently. I'm out of short range missiles. He is panicked. I wouldn't be surprised. If I had that many um, rockets coming at me, I would be panicked as well. Okay, we're going for the VTOL. Good. A couple of things going for the tank that we've already started on. Structure exposed. Crew compartment crate is gone. And there's the barrage. Impressive, but overall didn't do any significant damage. Commander. Yeah, the tank barrage is absolutely rubbish. Just putting that out there. I'm gonna go there. Mm -hmm. And we might as well continue firing on the VTOL. Because we might be able to take it out. And it's also our best hit chance. There we go, gone. It all. Target destroyed. So, two over here, two over the other side. Yeah. I think we're looking good. Um, I think I just sprint you a Understood. couple of turns. Moving fast. And I think I also go vigilance to get rid of your um, your stability damage. I don't want to keep that on there if I can help it. And yeah, sprinting you is also going to be helpful. Roger Just so we can actually get a line of sight to you from someone. We're not getting a very good hit chance, but... Yeah, there's no point firing. That just isn't worth it. Kind of wish I had sensor lock, but not yet. In time, I will have sensor lock. Oh, there goes one of my friends. Oh, I don't get the bonus for him Ready surviving. And I'm thinking you just stand still because no one seems to be bothered about you. I mean, I've even got a garbage hit chance, and I think I do need to cool down, actually. So that I don't cook myself. Protective stance. That would be stupid, especially when we've got... We've only got four turns left, and we're actually holding back the enemies quite well. Mostly because they're not firing on me at all. Or the building, should I say. Did we not have line of sight to that guy a minute ago? Whatever the whatever the reason, we don't have line of sight now, sadly. A little bit more damage. Burn damage. Wow, that's PPC. Okay, I don't like you. So the energy are PPCs. Yep. Oh, bad. I'm going to jump you because I want to be right on top of you and fire everything. Here we go. And where is it? There he is. Yeah, reasonable hit chances. It's in water. He's in water, so the heat isn't going to make too much difference. And in fact, we didn't really hit him at all. Yeah. Moving. Mm-hmm. I feel like I've left my urban mech an impossible task of trying to take out the guys on the other side. An impossible not. Maybe, maybe is it impossible? Here goes everything. It's not impossible. I think he can do it. Slowly. I think you 
If I move you forwards, 35. I'm going to put you in the water. Yeah, put you in the water to cool you down a little bit better. I think that's going to help, especially so we can alpha strike. Large lasers missed, but at least on the medium lasers hit. What are you doing? You're... Wow! How the hell does that mech have that many PPCs? That's interesting. I want to know what build this thing has. Sadly, our sensors aren't good enough that we can actually see. Machine guns. And the smoke is still there. That's insane. Right, so what has this guy got? So we've got two energy. Do you snub nose PPCs fire twice? They might do. Good to go. They may well do. And 18 hit chance, 26 hit chance. Oh, we can actually turn yeah, keep forgetting about stealth. Turning it on or off. Um, wait, I have to do it from... Oh, wait, no, stealth is on. Ah, okay. That's ECCM, so that's counter-jamming them. So that's actually blocking them, basically, from hitting. So they're not as accurate. Let's do it like that. I think we're going to be okay. Firing on target. Mm, one hit, so better than nothing. Inferno. That's not good because it hit me. And those more, um, not mortars, but artillery need to be more accurate. It's go time. Commander. Gremlin, I think it's time for you to punch. It's been a while, but let's do it. 72% chance of hitting. I think that's worth Location it. Confirmed. There we go. Minus four initiative. That's handy. Uh, that building nearly had a bit of the dust. What's that, boss? And I'm thinking. Okay. So the arm is open. I kind of want to go in his rear, if possible. I mean, going in the flames. That's stupid. Um, we are slowed down by the water quite significantly, apparently. Um, there's no point in me punching because we're not hot and I might as well go there. We do more damage firing. So let's fire. Here it comes. He didn't have a very good hit chance. I think he he's stealthed. It's obviously no the kill. bubble around him, so that's not good. That's hampering us yeah. a little bit. I'm thinking. We try for the overheat here. Because we might actually have a chance of doing that. Apart from the fact he's standing in water. Yeah, he's definitely running stealth. Which kind of sucks. And he's also got quite a high heat cap. So it's going to take all three of my mechs and all the turrets 
to even get close to taking that guy down. Yeah, let's continue on hitting the tank. I mean, ooh, we've also got a tank barrage again. We might as well fire it. Fire it. <laughs> Not as accurate this time, the tank barrage. I think that might come off, if I'm honest. Although, there's no point because we're going to get rid of the urban mech at the, at the first opportunity to do so. Guessing you did nothing. That's good. Ah, you switched it up. Damn, my countering caused that basically. Okay, we got some Inferno one out from. We got some Inferno friendly fire again. That sucks. Solid damage there. Ah, they're just not accurate, those guys. Okay, all missed, thankfully. I mean, they are getting closer to me, so maybe I should move closer, closer to them. So that... That's rear armor. And that's a reasonable hit chance. I mean, the rear arm has not been touched. Um, if I go there, that is... I think that's the side that's already got the broken arm. Now, I'm going to go in the rear. To evasion. Copy that. Because we can then flank him and he'll stress him out a little bit more. And he'll. I think we just actually overheat him this turn. A lot of that hits, so that's doing well. Commander. And then. Okay, we need to. We do need to move to get line of sight. So we might as well move for one evasion. Stay in the water. Simply because we've been hit by friendly fire and the inferno. Sadly, not as good a hit target or hit chance. But the medium lasers come through again. A radical compact heatsink kit active. Oh, I want that. I copy. That is a good piece of kit. And I think we go there. I copy. Chemical fire, but we're in the water, so that's fine. And I don't really want to destroy the center torso now, but sorry, I've gone there. Here go. He's panicked. He might panic out if we're lucky. You're still firing for that guy. Good. That means my urban mech is not getting fired upon. Receiving you. Which is really handy because he's on his own, remember? Ah, better hit chance. We're getting there. But I don't think we're ever going to get through his armor because we just don't do enough damage. But he's panicked, so we might not need to do enough damage. Just need to keep up the hard work. Oh yeah, and there's a tank up the top there that I keep forgetting about. Was that engine destroyed? Mag shot destroyed. Oh, he was running. Mag shot. Um, AP gauze rifle thingies. Interesting. Mission successful. Done. We didn't need to do any more. So we got the. 
once you call it down just in time, well, the um, turret's got it down just in time, so that we can actually have one thing to look at and salvage. Yep, we got some money. And uh, no internal damage. And... I mean, this, was it the sling? No. Inner Sphere Standards. So that, the five tons, are you kidding me? They are, they are infantry, aren't they? Uh, stock roll Firewalker. And then, so what was the... Uh, okay, it's so got three light PPCs. Okay, BA Flamer. So, quarter of a ton. Battle armor weapon's going to be mounted in power. Okay, so there. I mean, we can take battle armor now. That's insane. And that's the sling. Um, standard medium laser, the single medium pulse laser. Okay, garbage. And then the stinger. Yeah. Okay, so none of that's good. I mean, the cougar's the heaviest mech. Are the cougar is an Ashwang Omni-Mech including a mimetic armor to blend in the night ah so it's got that's yeah that's the stealth one was that the one we were fighting at the end and blew up at the end I think it was okay so battle armor infernos light PPC mag shots so one ton ten rounds included inside the gun uh, 30 damage, 3 heat, 5 stability. Interesting. 1 ton. I might be tempted with those. Small X poles, Streak MML, Beagle Probe. 10% increased sensor range and sight range. Yep. Uh, cockpit small advanced. Ah, uh, why are the tooltips gone again? Com suite, endo steel, fire control energy. Fire. Okay, grants breaching shot plus one. Okay, we're going to take that. Ferro fibers. I think I've got two of those spare. Gunnery support B. Yes. Taking that. And jump jets. Omni lower arm. That's helpful for something. I can't remember what. Standard calling, standard calling, stealth armor, warfare suites. That's 15%. Okay, I'm not going to take all these. It's, I want to see what else. Go back through it again. So, recon sensor would be good. Um, I wish I could see what else these gave us. That's three tons. That's one and a half tons. But the Warfare Suite is something that is needed. Um, I'm going to keep it as it is for the moment. I've got Energy Fire Control. Endo Steel. I've got one of those lying around. Compact Heat Sink Kit. Ah, that's coming off of the Radical Heat Sink Kit, but we don't have that. It got blown up. I mean, I'd like that. Uh, one Tactics. Com Suites. Gunnery. Grants Breaching Shot. That's actually really handy for the LB10 mech. Yes. That'd be really handy. Do I take that? Um... I think I do. I think I like everything that I've got. These though, the mag shots. Uh, light tank, nope. No, I think we confirm that. I'd rather take all this. So what do we get? We get one mag shots. Um, these guys can go. I don't think we need them. 
So shift cell, shift cell, and when we get an Inner Sphere Standards infantry parts, and we get Stinger parts, medium laser. Um, yeah, I'll keep it for the moment. Basic compact heating goods. Fire control standard. I'll sell it. Jump jets. We've got six of those already. We'll sell those. Stealth armor. AMS half ammo. Good. And AR A ammo streak LRM. We'll keep that. So, overall, pretty good. Now, I would love to have had the, all three of the mag shots because then I could have fun with one of my mechs and put all three of those in one of them because they don't really weigh all that much. Um, but we only got one of them, so... Doesn't... Yeah. I mean, it's 30 damage for one ton and very little heat. So they do work. They really do work. Uh, 15,000 sea bills. That's fine. Right, we are going to be going over the um, financial report in a second. But first off, um, it's the you that need to change something. So let's give it all its armor. That arm nearly went. Wow. And then one ton... there. Ah, I can't put the mag shot on because I'm... I can't put the mag shot on here. That sucks. I would love to of. Um, admittedly, yeah. How much does the stealth farm away? Nothing. So therefore, do I need stealth? And that's three. Uh, three days of repairs. So if we go there and put ferro fibers. That's given us almost a ton. And what about engine cores? Uh, two ten, two ten. Okay. So that doesn't help us. All uh, right. So let's go to. I wanted the fire control. To, you've got fire control melee. As much fun as that is, I would rather have that for the moment because it gives this more of a punch. And we're using this more than punching because we're just not that great. And... Uh, I mean... I can put... What else can I put on here? We've got a melee gyro. Good. We don't need any heat sinking. That's the thing. But these don't weigh anything. No. Um, the other thing I do need, and I might as well put on here, is gunnery support B. Because, again, LBX needs all the firepower it can get. And this isn't an Omni lower, is it? No. So, what else are we missing? It's just the life support A now, isn't it? Com suite we've got. And advanced sensors. I can't tell what it does. Um, ECM 1 and probe 1. Okay. Basically, it allows me to see things better, as far as I can tell. And cockpit basic. So, the com suite is that. Small advanced? Ah, no, that doesn't help us. Because that gets rid of life support A. Fire control improved. Gets rid of the Mark II. No, I'd rather have that. Okay, so it's four days. 42,000. Makes it better, and that's helpful. And... Do we... That's a double heat sinking kit. I mean, yeah, we don't need any of that, do we? Do I put the supercharger in there? It has to go in there. 
which means the spikes have to go I just don't suppose it matters where they go yeah I don't think that's truly needed and what if I max that out we're still I've got some more cluster ammo, haven't I? No. So is there anything else I could put in here? I don't think there is. In that case... Do I put a beagle probe in? It's one and a half tons. I mean, I could probably get away with it. Down to 55. How much do the spikes weigh? Half a ton. How much does the claws weigh? Half a ton plus 0 0.71. I'm guessing that's because it's something weird that it can't show me because I've lost the tooltips. Um, no, you know what? I'm going to put this, that back in and then we're just going to armour up again because I don't think it truly matters. Yeah, that works. In fact, I might drop a little bit there to give us a little bit more on the legs. Just to keep myself from breaking the legs. Um, that works. I mean, it's better now. The LBX is going to be hitting more. So right. that's fine. I'll get it in the um, Fire starter. Let's take a quick look at you. 202 damage you took and that's it. So... Uh, max the armor. Yep, that's that repaired. Now... Flamer, 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 flamer. SRMs... So, we are full, except here, but there's no room there. In fact, there's no room anywhere for any extra weapons. So if I want to add anything extra, it comes at the expense of what we've already got. But I think internals might be more important here, in terms of... terms of maybe yeah we're too we're not with these these going to bigger mechs energy no fire control improved yep plus one gunnery that's going to help us and omni lower arm i need one more three slots um C3 unit, I can't remember what it does. Guardian ECM is definitely needed. Double heat sinks are needed. Yes, are needed. So, I mean, the Omni Arm, Omni -arm is helpful, but it's going to be helpful later on. Although, having the extra hit capacity here would be helpful. So the small jump jumps are half a ton, aren't they? I mean, we're already low on the leg armour. Guardian ECM, C3 units is an ECM... Yeah, so... I think we just repair that mech. Don't need to change anything there. Oh, wait. We do well. We need to do. Okay, so we have to do the repairs that way. Fair enough. And it costs us more doing that way. That sucks. Okay, well, it's good to know for later on. No one that's done. And you know what? No, I forgot. No, there was one thing that I can put in there. I'm being an idiot. Absolutely an idiot. 
So max the armor expensively, and then we're putting the fire control improved in there. There we go. Logged and noted. So you're a bit more accurate anyway. Okay, well, you know what? Let's skip over one day, get rid of the financial reports, get the Argo upgraded, and then see what the new missions are for next time. Hey, boss. We've just That's done. You, yeah. We're well in range of that. And... Awesome. So, command center. We should get some new missions. Make yourself uh, we get a destroyed base. Destroy base in the jungle. Capture base. Solo jewel. Interesting. Any other jewels? I mean, there's quite a lot of missions here that we can take on. And in all fairness, ambush convoy might be easy. Yeah, I mean. We've got some good missions there. But anyway, that's going to do it for this video. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to hit the like button. If you've got any comments and any ideas of what I should be doing to get rid of my urban mech and get a new mech quicker, then remember to hit the subscribe button. But until next time, no, sorry. If you've got any ideas, put them in the comments field below. And if you want to hit the subscribe button, go ahead because it shows support for the channel. But anyway, until next time, have fun and enjoy the rest of your day.